to another train simulator live stream. Now, yeah, I didn't realise, but there's been an update for about three weeks now to the Southeastern network. No one ever mentioned it. Um, and it's version 1.1, 1 .1, as I suppose before it was 1.0. Um, and it adds the uh, Swanley down to... Swanley down to somewhere section. It's Swanley and it joins back up. Uh, I think near Seven Oaks, uh, so that bit's now got scenery. It's now got stations, Battenball, the Shoreham in Kent. Those sorts of stations are now in the game. So we're gonna give it a go, give it a try. Uh, as yeah, I'm I'm quite uh, disappointed we didn't find out sooner. Uh, but yeah, it came out on the 19th of February, so it's been been a couple of weeks or so. Anyway, we've got Krasa, Callum, George, Dobbies. We've got Joshua, Davidoff, and Joseph. How are you all getting on? And yeah, the Southeastern Network is probably one of the best free rail routes you can get on the workshop, uh, which combines lots of the Southeastern routes together, adds in the missing links and stuff. So it's good stuff. So one leads to Seven Oaks, yeah. So we're going to be checking that. We're starting at Blackfriars, and then we're going to go down to Seven Oaks. So we're in a 700 uh, this evening. The AP one as well, make that clear. Once it loads in, probably will take a little while, as it's quite a big, expansive route. Lovely, as we uh, as we wait. Good to hear, Joseph. Um, all good. Hopefully, you're all well. Well, you said you're good, so that's good. <clears throat> Come on, notice in. Uh, hello, Squareface George. I'm alright. How are you? Hello, Luke. Yes, I don't have the. Oh, that's the only thing I don't have is simply just some JNA wagons. Okay, and probably the 66 as well. Good afternoon, driver. You continue your day's work on board 700057 for the service 9 Yankee 39 to 7 Oaks. Set up your train and prepare for departure at 46 pass. And remember that you are driver only operated all the way, boo. So adhere to your working timetable. All meant to depart within the allotted times. Safe travels. That would be cool, yeah. At some point, remember, we'll see that. Uh, so we've got a reduced length unit. Oh, that probably makes sense to do that. There we go. Um, nice. I think I'm going to go back to Generation Zero, not sure. Sure at some point. There you go, DST is now active. Game runs so smooth. Smooth-ish. I mean, it is, I suppose this is the busiest part of the route and it's at 25. Which to anything I suppose above 25 is smooth-ish. Uh, let's make sure we're in the right mode as well. That's not that one. I'm pressing random buttons here. Uh, drive operated. Actually, I probably want to do SDO. Hello, Amanda. Is there ever been a guard on a 700? No. Uh, we need to change that to Seven Oaks. Seven Oaks be exciting stuff. New update. Well, newish update. I can't believe I didn't know about this beforehand. Uh, I would have been straight on it. So I'll probably do this stream, then I'll probably do a video on it as well. Which the video will probably just be me saving it just before we get, once we get to Swanley and then taking it down to Seven Oaks. Let's see, oh that's a lot. Um, so we'll do that 55 pass, it's about an hour and 10 minutes. Um, I can't see that, I'm guessing I see why, I think it's at Swanley. Yeah, cool. So we'll do out of uh, Blackfriars. At 46 past, that's now. Hello, transport 101. Oh, see, that's not good, Callum. How's the audio as well? I will be doing this run with the. Let's see. Yeah, we'll do this one with the. We're gonna have to have the HUD on for this. Especially as we're going on to a new bit as well. I probably could do this bit hudless, but then once we get onto the Catford loop, I'd have to turn it on anyway. So we'll just keep it on. Is there guards on the 707s? No, I don't think so. We're in a 700 tonight. I know the thumbnail is a 707, but that's the only one I had. So. Good, okay, Joseph. So we're leaving London Blackfriars. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it, Callum? This makes trains a lot safer. And obviously, sort of, 
attempts fair evaders away, and they're usually sort of the rough ones, aren't they? So makes it a lot safer having someone on the train. Acts as a deterrent, I suppose. Is there ETCS on this line? Uh, yes. Can't remember, I can't remember which level. I'm still quite sort of confused about ETCS. I'm still getting used to it, still trying to learn it. I think it's level 1. Level 1 on here? Well, I don't think every driver uses it, though. Fair enough, George. I've got one for you. The Spa Valley Railway. That's... I don't think that's been done. Because then, that would also be quite nice, because then you could possibly uh, sort of tie in the Uckfield branch with that. Would I return to City Skylines? Probably not. Due to the fact that to have 25 tiles, you've got to be in cheat mode. So, um, no. Not even that. Uh, no, not Dartford yet. Probably could have sped up a bit there, but oh well. So, we're eight coaches. Will this session come? Do you mean oh, this train or this route? Um, I guess this train, hopefully, in future. I think it would do dovetail very, very well. And they could use it on many routes as well. It'd be great to get another one of these types of route. Another third rail, London. Fantastic that would be. There we are. Mike is going. What do you mean Mike is going? And then after this, we'll do well, drew out for 50. Uh, so that's fine. Lovely. As we wait. So we're going on the new section of the track. Let's get the door shut. Uh, which, which we, well, I'll show you at the next station, Denmark here. Does the guide bell work on the 700? Yes. That. And we're off. Denmark Hill next. Uh, you got to save your money for rent and you went a bit mad on first night and brought yourself a gaming PC for £100. Hmm. Hello, Mella. How are you? Alright, dab it off. Hello, Daniel. How are you as well? That wasn't off Facebook, was it? Um, dab it off. Let's give it a week and something will probably break. Uh, no, you can't 101. Fair enough, Callum. So making our way out of uh, sort of central London. Good to hear, Mella. Yeah, I'm alright. I'm all good. Hey, Mighty Wish. This route attraction looked familiar. How do I, Mighty Wish? We're going down to Seven Oaks. So I have absolutely no idea about the speed limits down this way, so I've got to keep the HUD on. Well, a rough idea of this area to Peckham Rye, then after that, not a clue. From Curry's and PC World? From Curry's PC World? Okay, a bit better then. But a £100 gaming PC. 
Or was it like on a really good sale or something? I mean, fair enough to have it off. Yeah, it is Krazer. Well, not a fail, but yeah, just the fact you need to disable trophies and pretty much go in cheat mode to have 25 tiles just ruins it. I like trophies. <laughs> Fair enough, Callum. Across we go. So we got 057 for the run down to Seven Oaks. And once we get to Denmark Hill, I'll show you where we're actually going. At least the newish bit. So this is Loughborough Junction. Does anyone know when and why they shut these platforms here? Was it a recent closure or quite, a, you know, many years ago they shut, sort of abandoned these ones? South Eastern on train sim. Well, yeah, South Eastern network, sure is. Fair enough, George. Is this the, the healthy train? The healthy train? Uh, oh, yes, I suppose so, yes. This is not the flu train, this is the RLU one. Which I rarely go on. Down this way, it's always the um, Dash 1s. So, so it's always weird seeing a... Um, one of these, it's like, oh, the Mini 700. Because I think these run the Luton to Rainham. Oh, well, let's put that down. Yeah, Luton to Rainham. They run that one, I know that. And this one, the one down to Seven Oaks. Which I think is from. Where's, the, where's this one from? Oh, I suppose we're Blackfriars. <laughs> and then we come up to Denmark Hill. Oh, I see George. Uh oh, as much as it. I best cover the power button now. She will stand on it. There we are. Yes, hello, Smudge. He's standing on the PC trying to budge onto the chair. Not too helpful. <laughs> also, might I wish uh, the RLUs are bread and butter well in, although we drive the 700 dust ones on the Cambridge services. Uh. Come on, Em. On you go. Come on. Smudges, smudges arrived. Do I have the signal enhancement pack? I do. Right, hang on. Denmark kill. 58. Yeah, I'm not sure out of here just yet. So we've got to wait. Black fries. I don't know. Oh, so I can't see it it cuts it off, but I can see a K there, so I'm just in Denmark. So 58 would you out of here? What for dinner? Probably curry. What route are we doing? Oh, yes. Well reminded. Uh, so we're going out of Black Fries. Um, no, Black Fries. And then down. Uh, we're going on the Catford Loop, uh, which takes us through here. And then down here, we've all seen this bit before, and this is the new bit. So from Swanley to Seven Oaks, which includes the stations of. Oh god, what's that? Ensford? Uh, Ainsford? Um, Shoreham? The fake Shoreham, not the real Shoreham by sea. Uh, Batten Bull. Yeah, so you've got those new stations there, and then Seven Oaks, which is at the end there. So that is where we're going, and that's the line off towards uh, Maidstone. Would I return to police sim? Uh, don't know. Oh, I've got a question for you, Mighty Wush. Do you sign down to Ashford? Because on the uh, Thames Link map, it has like the sort of dotted line down to Ashford. So how often do Thameslink actually go down to Ashford, if they do it at all? And do many drivers sign that? 
I suppose it would be a similar scenario to the Little Hampton. Astragon is live with BS21 and German. Alright. Not long, then we'll be off. You've got some of your homemade lasagna tonight, nice. There's another 378, which is one of the weirdest sounding trains in in train sim. But you'll hear the doors closing when it actually gets moving. It's really weird. This versus Kings and Kings Cross, but this is free, so it's hard. You can't really compare the two, really, can you? No, you can't really compare the two. Right, let's go. Any news on that West Coast though, route? George is in the chat, so feel free to uh, at him. I think it's uh, still go still going, making progress. Yeah, I like showing off these routes. I suppose given a bit of time in the uh, spotlight, even though this is pretty much all in the spotlight already. We were supposed to sign to Ashford with the Cambridge. Oh, the track's going fast there. Based on East Sales, however, it has forever been put on hold. Oh. That is a weird service, though. Cambridge to Maidstone East. Wow. You hear that door set and bug? It's annoying, isn't it? It's a bit wired. You don't understand what they are talking about in German. Uh, I mean, I'm not surprised that bit off. <laughs> you thought Thames Inc. goes to East Grinstead? They do. Yeah, I think at uh, peak times, one or two services. Don't know for sure. Love that little sort of weird extra routes what Thames Inc. do. Little Hampton, East Grinstead. Little extras. Wasn't this route with ton of requirements? That's the certain old valley line. Which is another great free rail route. There's so many great third rail free rail routes. They're driving back to London. Uh, no, just to Seven Oaks. Uh, Peckham Rye, uh, 1501. Timetable's being nice with us. Evening, Mick. How are you? Welcome in. Have you seen Transport Fever 2, Mick? I'll tell you it's a fairly straightforward platinum. I've already got like 30 of the trophies. Oh, the two Charlie 700s from King's Cross to Cambridge are part of the Maidstone East services, just never went down the core. Uh, the idea is that they run fast from London Bridge to Swanley, perhaps one day. That'd be fun to drive, fast as Swanley from London Bridge. Is it 1501 we're out of here? Yeah, 1501, then Nunhead next, which isn't Nunhead like the highest station in elevate or sort of elevation wise in London. Doesn't even seem that high. Timetable is extremely padded uh, towards seven oaks, it's impossible to be late. Well that's good for me then. <laughs> Hello Ferrari, how are you? Amaroff. Mighty Wish, what do you think of the Rift Rule of the 3 on freeze? As I know you're you quite like the 3 on freeze, didn't you? I mean fair enough. And now they're obviously sort of fully going now. Fair enough, mate. This might be the last time you probably watch because you're leaving in three to five weeks. What, holiday or you're just leaving? <laughs> you have to start packing up. Oh, move, moving house? Well, that's all good, Ferrari. Just come in when you, when you, when you want to. He is Valentino, yeah. Hello gaming videos, how are you? So this is Nunhead. Here we are. Cool. 
Yeah, it's nice to actually see though a route which includes um, more sort of the southeastern metro area. Because you know, we had sort of South London network stuff like that sort of officially, but the southeastern metro had sort of been left a bit sort of untouched. So it's nice to now have the workshop route which sort of well covers those areas. I just hope we see a three seven six one day. A three seven six would be uh, would be great. Uh, we miss them on Great Northern still for sure. Can you imagine the mileage they've racked up? Millions of miles probably. What was that? No, probably millions or so. I don't know. What's the average mileage a train does in its life? That's probably quite hard to tell. It's only going to be the 377 you think on 387 on East Coast, way. Eh? Well... Uh, none head drew up at 15.04. Oh, I mean, that's 20 seconds before departure. I think that's what you have to look at it 20 seconds before. Up to 30 seconds. That shut. 3.78 EP. Oh, yes, that is very much needed. Three six fives had a mileage counter in the cab. Oh, believe it or not. Nice. What was sort of the typical mileage of one of those uh, mighty wish? And it is Crofton Park next. We mentioned it a couple of months ago, people didn't get it, and it's just driving the emotion. So I'm not too sure what the next phase for this route will add. Um, does anyone know what's the next step for this route? I thought it's probably going out towards sort of Dartford way. Definitely in the millions. <laughs> You've been driving a free part rail tour scenario over yesterday and today. You're going to do the final part back to Waterloo. Awesome. The 376 and 378 look similar. Uh yeah. Obviously they don't have the gangways at the front, do they? Next from AP you think is the one six six. Does that not already have an enhancement pack? It's been out years, the one six six. Evening Glen, North Kent line via Dartford and Gravesend. That'd be good to see them. Then we can do some sort of joint journey between... Oh, that's fantastic, actually. Because, yeah, once that comes out, we can do some sort of joint journey between Train Sim World and Train Simulator. I mean, maybe even replicate um, sort of a full southeastern service um, going up that way. That'd be cool. Or sort of Gravesend to London. Or in future, if we see a 700 in Train Sim World... We could, you know, the full sort of rain them up to uh, Luton, which is possible if you sort of com combine the the two games together. That'd be awesome. Awesome, Glenn. Lovely. You've got 378. Still has four car trains. Is it only five cars now? Uh, oh, bright Ferrari. That wouldn't be any good. Um, let's see. 1507. Well, that's fine. Let's get the door shut. Hey, Mel. How are you? Welcome in. How are you doing? Good luck, George. Catford next. I'm also going to save the game as well. Just in case.
I don't actually, what stations do we have on this journey? So we've got Catford, Bellingham, Beckenham Hill, Ravensbourne, Shortland, Bromley South, Bickley, St Mary Cray, Swanley, Ainsford, Shoreham, not not the real Shoreham, the fake Shoreham, uh, Otford, uh, Batten Bull and Seven Oaks. Love that name, Batten Bull. You do like, it's a good route, isn't it? It's a good route. So, we're whisking our way through London. Well, isn't Swanley in Kent, though? I think that's one of the first stations in Kent. It's all good, uh, Ferrari. Head TX, uh, how you doing? I'm all good. Book time in York next month to see Flying Scotsman at the museum. Awesome. That'd be good. There's a networker. Is it four, six, five? Yeah. And yeah, this here is Catford. Bamboo is feral. <laughs> oh, awesome, uh, Mel. On Friday, you sometimes go on the 700 for a three minute journey from Red Till to Ellswood for the gym. Fair enough. There we go. Hold it. Uh, right, Catford. Catford, Catford, Catford. That was none aired. Uh, 1510. That's fine. So we'll get another sort of 15 seconds and then we'll get them shut. I've just noticed here there's no people at these stations, are there? They're sort of completely empty. Alright, Valentino. Oh, we need to put some neutral there. Oops. Belling on next. Yeah, so we're checking out a newish section, which came out back in mid February. If it's raining, you get the bus, and always an E200. Lovely. What's that? The 420? I'm going to guess. 420. I think that's one which goes into white bushes, doesn't it? Or 460. When are we doing ETS 2 next? No idea. Oh, compass. Alright. I didn't think they had any routes up sort of that way. Not too far to Bellingham. And then once we get to Shortlands, then we join up with the um, Chatham Main Line. Which would be awesome to see that bit in Train Sim World. If we did have a 700 on South Eastern High Speed, how would it be transferred to the... Oh, Route 32, I don't know. Here we are. To London commuter, probably some sort of layer system, like what we've seen with other sort of German routes and stuff. I things layer across. I mean, hopefully that would be the case. How did Brighton get on, Glenn? Did they win? Oh no, yeah, Daniel Sports leads, doesn't he? Yeah, well, that's just, I guess that was a score then. It was a draw. Let's see, that was uh, Bellingham. So I guess that's probably that one there. So 13 passed. Hey, gifted a BA membership. Davidoff and George got it. Much appreciated, uh, Davidoff, mate. That's very nice of you. And a well deserved recipient. <laughs> George being the developer of the West Coastway route. Which you can also find on the Steam Workshop. 
third rail power on the workshop. What's it after this? Uh, is it Ravensbourne? Ravensbourne's next. Oh, oh no, yeah, no, yes. Hang on. Beckenham Hill. I think, yeah. And the door shut. Guess what? Not sure, Davido. Unless that was the message before you sent the uh, membership. Yeah, very nice to you. That's not good, Clay. And we're off. And yeah, just to reiterate, this route's free. Uh, this. Well, there are requirements for it, but on the Steam Workshop, it's free. It's the 7 redacted. How do you doing, SNC? Limshit King is back. Nice. But I'm looking forward to seeing the new bit. Never been on it in real life, never really seen anything on Swan Lee down to Seven Oaks in real life, so looking forward to it. <laughs> Maybe uh, Ferrari. And this is Beckenham Hill. Yeah, who would like to see this train in Train Sim World? Or even this route, I suppose. This route and train. I suppose maybe we, we could see the 700 in the game through something like this. Maybe they'd develop a sort of separate route and then layer it onto the other routes. I don't know. Here we are. Next up is Ravensbourne. Now we drew out of here. Was it Beckenham Hill? Uh, 15 pass. So, yeah, that's fine. Fair enough, Glenn. Cool. I wonder if at some point we'll also see sort of a full uh, upgrade to this train from um, AP. I don't know, this is the enhancement pack for it, but I wonder if at some point we'd actually see, um, you know, things like GSMR working, maybe these screens being on. Any tips on a gaming channel? Be consistent. Yeah, quite a lot of people sort of coming in and saying they're going to do a YouTube and they work on it for sort of a couple of months, nice and consistent. And then they're like, oh, I'm, I'm giving up now. Can't be bothered. I've seen it happen many times. Feels like we're a bit more uh, out in the open now. Getting away from London. I mean, where, where is the border of Kent? Is, isn't Swanley the first place within Kent? Bromley's not Kent, is it? No. South East London. Here we are. Welcome to Bromley. There, uh, to Ravensbourne. Not oh, bloody Bromley. Here we are. The door's open. And we're due out of here at, let's have a look. Uh, it'll be that one there probably, so not long. And it's Shortlands next. I 
Lovely looking trains though, aren't they? The um, Desaro cities. Very nice looking. Is this the last stream? Yes, yeah, will be the last one. No more after this. Not oh, smudges on the desk. What are you doing? <laughs> Come on, down there. Hello, train spotter seven. How are you? Under we go. And up into Shortlands, hopefully. Yeah, version 1.1 of this route. And this is a scenario by CrankyBot, which you can find on the um, Alan Thompson Sim website. It's only because I saw this, I was thinking, hang on, maybe this route's actually updated. And I had a look, and it sure was. There's an Electro Star. Have I got the new AP Weather Pack? Uh, no. Now I'm, I'm quite sort of alright with the Weather Pack we got on here. Sort of just the Weather Pack 1. I'm happy with that for now. I'll probably get the new one on a sale or something. I know there's not many sales on AP, but when there is, I'll probably get it then. That's good, Ricky. We've still got ages to go. About half an hour still. <laughs> he does, Daniel. He does. It was good, though. It was a good stream. And Transport Fever, too. Shortlands, 20 past. You're not allowed to drive for... Two weeks, two days. I can hear in a network or somewhere. It's around that corner. Bromley South next. For two, oh wow. The only issue you spotted on AP700 is the right window doesn't put any additional sound in the cab. When I finlay. I was hoping at some point we do see sort of a full, you know, that's almost a full EP for this. Because you can't use the GSMR or anything on here. On here. So none of this is on over here. Maybe at some point we'd see that. I suppose I know there are other updates available for this elsewhere. And around into Bromley South. And after that it's then Bickley, I think. Bickley, St Mary Cray, then Swanley. I think we're stopping at St Mary Cray. But yeah, looking forward to seeing the uh well, a new bit of track. What's the difference between FLU and RLU? One's eight coaches and one's twelve coaches. Reduced length unit, full length unit. There we are. There we go. Uh, you have an enhancement pack for the AP enhancement pack. That, ooh, an enhancement pack for the enhancement pack, which edits the seats, adds side destinations, does a few different configurations to the cab. Oh, I see. has little door button covers. Long train yet. Yeah. We're down in the south. 12 coach trains you'll just see everywhere. Now, quite a sight, well, quite a common sight down here. Right, we drew out of Bromley South at 23 past. Hello, Steve. PC seems to look better than PS5. 
on what game, um, Steve? On this game? This one's only on the um, PC. Does look good though, doesn't it? Oh dear, Daniel. So there's no surprise, really. Right, let's go. Bickley. Uh, no, Callum. That'd be weird. <laughs> he might support France now, Glenn. Well, my PC specs, well, now I've got a 1660 Super. I think 16 gigabytes of RAM. And it's an NVIDIA, yeah, NVIDIA graphics card. And that's about all I can remember. There's another 700. London Blackfriars. Yeah, nice run though down to uh, Seven Oaks. So I suppose I wonder when we'll see the next step for this game, which is, yeah, I think someone said the North Kent line. I mean, the last update for this was the 19th of February, which was two months after the original release, I think. So probably, I suppose, two, three months. So it's a much bigger section. <laughs> oh, awesome, uh, Callum. And this is Bickley. I forgot the all board just at the end there. I wish they would have got added in because I think this route actually uses the 2016 version of the Chatter mainline. Um, because otherwise it would probably just crash. Because the 2016 version of the Chatham Mainline only goes down to uh, Gillingham or Raynham. Whereas the new one goes to Dover and uh, Ramsgate. But this one uses the 2016 version. So I suppose all of the balls have been apt to be popped in um, by Nicholas. Get a nice little screenshot. There we go. And we drew out of here uh, 26. So we'll give it a few more seconds and then we shall get going. So we've got about half an hour now to. We'll not even that to, uh, to our final stop. There we go. And almost on the new bit. <laughs> We're getting there. Nice. And that is how far away to St Mary Cray? Two and points well, two point seven six miles. That would be cool, yeah, announcements on uh, on a seven hundred. That'd be awesome. Awesome, uh Callum. Might as well I suppose, might as well. Yeah, once we get to Swanley, that's where we then go on to the uh, new bit of uh, track. Swanley to Seven Oaks. You like the sound of the 700s and the Desaro family? They sound nice, don't they, the Desaros? So that then goes off towards Alpington and Seven Oaks. That's, a, I suppose, more direct way to Seven Oaks. But we go the slower way. There we go.
But yeah, we'll set one up to this evening. Maybe you're playing Train Sim yourself on Transport Fever 2. What is everyone doing? I've got a Thrustmaster T150 Callum. Which works a treat on both PC and PlayStation 4 and 5. Had it for almost four years. <laughs> Fair enough, Arta. How you doing, Arta? Welcome back. Now we could speed up a little bit, although it is quite a bit of a downhill gradient into St. Mary Cray. Although we'll still do it. Let's go. That's the uh, DSD. Get that up a little bit. Watching Crystal Palace versus Man City. Nice, Daniel. I guess Man City will probably win that. It is quite steep down into St. Mary Cray. Got an Electro Star coming up. Got that down. Oh, lovely, Amela. What have you got? Yeah, there'll only be one stream tomorrow. No idea what that will be on yet. I mean, it'll be either Train Sim World or Train Sim. Yeah, I'll be out all day tomorrow, so. Just the one. Almost at Swanley. Almost there. And then onto that we've all been waiting for. Bring it down a bit much there. Uh. Well, this is a ripper. Avocados, nice. That's just half of it, ish. Then Swanley next. Uh, we drew out of here, St Mary Cray. Uh, 31 past. Yeah, 31 I think. I do, man, they're good. Or chicken as well. Uh, you've done your lessons in a solo and done your tests in a clips B7 R R O with the old cab, nice. You just I've already I've 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 uninstalled Transport Fever 2 on the PC. Now it's on the console. Well, I don't need to play it on PC. I'm saying unless we want mods. Let's go. <laughs> Swanley's in two point, well, pretty much two and a half miles. So I think we they are pretty much in Kent now. I'm also going to save it at Swanley as well, so I'll probably do a separate video which just does this bit from Swanley to Seven Oaks. So anyone who doesn't see the stream can then, well, see that. <laughs> Fair enough, Krazza. It's like the firm bus, that's gone off the PC now. It's quite nice, I'm sort of slowly seeing the sort of icon slowly disappearing as things go over to console. I suppose one day it will literally just be Train Sim Classic and Omsi on there. Oh wow, man, what is going on? Since last week. Letting down the team. Yeah, 
There we go. Cool. You wonder if ETS2 will be on console? That would be cool. Maybe one day. Catching up with that 375. Well, that, that probably won't be stopping at Swanley. We'll be going straight the way through. Where's King Carrot when you need him? As we're coming up to uh, Swanley. <laughs> oh wow. It'll be if they manage to upgrade the game engine. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> Hello Moses, how are you? And this is Swanley. Yeah, I'm all good, Moses. Hopefully, you're all well. You ever played Autobahn Police Simulator? I haven't, no. Well, I've not really heard good things about it. Oh, there's the RL. They're tucked, tucked down the bottom there. Here we are. New Glover 700, fair enough. Um, so we drew up Swanley at 36 past. And yeah, now we're going to go on to the new section. 707s are nice, yeah, the city beams. It's weird though, just little five coach Desaro cities. Well, I think most of the time they just run as a double, don't they? So I wonder if we we'll need SDO along here. They just seem like they'll be small stations. Could uh, RLU means reduced length unit, and then FLU means full length unit. It's just for the uh, 700s, and I think the 717s. No, 717s, no, 700s. And on we go. Yeah, so for the 700s that uh, they are. You've been on a 717 on the Northern City line. Well, I think the 717's just uh, like a 700 with the different cab, isn't it? And obviously been a bit shorter as well. Used to live in Swan Lake, nice. Oh, welcome, welcome back, welcome home. So this is all new, this is. Well, new to us, at least. And we got 70. I think it has an, yeah, it has the staircase at the front, doesn't it? For the um, tunnels. Nice thing there. squeaky blind probably use the um, seats on the uh, electro stars and you pop them up and down like that that's squeaky sound uh, I guess so crazy yeah I'll see Evan hey Theo how are you you're going to behave yourself this evening fair enough Gregory 
bit of a tunnel coming up as well. So it's been about an hour since we left uh, London Blackfriars now. And we've got about 15 minutes to Seven Oaks. Have I sat on the 345 seats? Yeah, they're rock hard. Uh, it tricked me. When, when I went on the um, Elizabeth line, I sort of got on the train and I was like, oh, they actually look quite... Because the, the padding sort of goes down the front, doesn't it? So I was like, oh, they actually look quite comfy. So I sort of plodded myself down quite firmly. And I was like, oh, ouch. <laughs> they're not nice. They're not nice seats. Horrible. And these are like the side ones. Because I think you get sort of the ones which stick out. These were the side ones. Yeah, not nice. Some sort of old station there. Some sort of raised bit there. Up a hilly round here. Wow. Like we just ended up in the Lake District or something all of a sudden. Look at this. Are we south of, just south of London or up north in the Lake District? Who knows? Proper change in, uh, in the landscape all of a sudden. Nice. Nice, uh, Krasa. I reckon it's going to be SDO here, isn't it? Hello, London buses. Yeah, I'm all good for you. Or maybe not, actually. We might fit in. Sure is, uh, London buses. How could it not be? I don't know. I think we might all fit in. Oh, actually, I don't know. Yes, maybe. Is it front seven? I oh, know, I don't maybe not. Or maybe just about all fit in. Now nah, that's got to be SDO. Let's head to SDO just in case. What's that front seven coaches? Yeah, front seven. Had to ditch the bus outside the hospital, and it was an Allison Enviro 200 MMC, which was gutted. About since then, we are favourite spec. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? <laughs> it was like we're up north somewhere, all of a sudden. Hello, Xavier. I'm alright. How are you? Go away, platform duties complete. I want to get a screenshot. Bugger off. There. Right, uh, Einsford. Uh, we're due out here at 41. Oh, nice poses. Yes. Change that. Right, let's go. Shoreham next. Not the Shoreham I know. Shoreham by C. Oh, nice car. I can throw an Electro Star on its way. I probably would have come up from Maidstone. Exciting on this bit. So I think we've got Shore and then Bat and Bull. No, o Otford. Uh, Bat and Bull and then Seven Oaks. Nice. I'm going to do that 55. Whistle. There we go. Scenery's been done nicely as well, just like the rest of the, uh, rest of the route. It's quite a deep cutting here, isn't it? I almost feels like there should be like a tunnel or something. Look how, look how uh, deep the cutting is here. Wow. Definitely agree, agree. Yes, buzz. Yeah, 70 miles an hour. Fairly nice speed. Yeah, never been along this bit in real life, down to uh, Seven Oaks. Yeah, down to Seven Oaks. <laughs> they sure did, Evan.
you have the Boston uh, Sprinter DLC, what should you get next? You want to get uh, the new one, New York, Trenton, uh, Octavia. Because then, if you get the SL, it will then go over to that service. And I suppose that's sort of the next best thing to get. Yeah, the New York, Trenton route, Xavier. Another part of the Northeast Corridor. So the same route, but just hundreds of miles south. Was there not London buses? And here we are. This is sure and we're coming up to. <laughs> Fair enough, uh, Callum. This station is sure and by say, if only. Well, I suppose, yeah, it's Thameslink do stop at two Shoreham's, don't they? This Shoreham and uh, Shoreham by Sea. And here we are. Nice Callum. You think front six? I think all of it fits in. Yeah, uh, well, just about. I didn't actually open those doors, but... Yeah, I think that would be... I mean, yeah, uh, maybe front seven. But you probably could fit open all of them there. Well, they're saying that just for a little bit, a little bit of leeway, they might just uh, lock this door. Or lock the coaches at that, in that one. Right, Otford next. I know, in real life, would that be front seven? And we're off. It is not far away. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, lovely scenario. This one, yes, by a cranky bot on ATS. Love that screaming sound as they pick up speed. Let's get back in. Fair enough, in there. I mean, it's not completely enhanced, you haven't got the GSMR and stuff, but it is a, a big improvement. Otford. Close that. And down to 40. Yeah, it's nice, Xavier, isn't it? It's a nice, uh, nice cab. Nice and open, unlike most uh, UK trains. You got over the M26 near Oxford. Ah. What am I doing after this? Recording. I'll probably do this again, but only from Swanley to uh, Seven Oaks. For anyone who didn't see the stream. Is the Class 700 coming to train some while free? Who knows? Not in the roadmap. Hello, Common France. How are you? Here we are.
Lovely. Yeah, nice little bit of trackage, though. So, bat and ball after this. And we'll do out of here at 48. So much as soon as it says platform duties complete, we'll get the door shut. In fact, let's do that now. Not too far to bat and ball. That should be about seven minutes to Seven Oaks. You feel like the 700 might not fit train symbol for it. It just feels a bit off. What do you mean by that? Too modern or... Oh no, the 385's in the game. I mean, the 700 could go onto two routes. The BML or South Eastern High Speed. <laughs> Fair enough, uh, Xavier. That's alright. There's a little honk there. Full power. And we got rid of. Oh my god, look at the gradient coming up there. Straight up there. So that goes off towards Maidstone. Then then, then down towards um, Ashford, I think, down that way. We've got a really steep gradient up into uh, Seven Oaks. Well, we've got a 20 limit, so I'm guessing that's probably where Seven Oaks is. Yeah, this is just there. Uh, Oh, a nice little extra bit. There wouldn't be, or there would be a Bedford route. I mean, 700s run on third row as well. That's a good question. I wonder what sort of uh, mileage wise, what do 700s run on more, third row or overhead wires? Must be third rail they run more on, surely. Well, they're saying that they do King's Cross up towards Peterborough, and that's a sort of 80 odd miles. Now, surely they must run on more third rail than uh, overhead. And 50 miles up towards sort of Peterborough, uh, no, uh, Bedford. 130, then Cambridge. 160. What about 160 miles worth of overhead territory? You do fit in there. Just about. I didn't open, but you do. And we're curling up towards Seven Oaks. Fair enough, Finlay. If you count the Little Hampton as well, so 20 and 50, 70, then all this area, yeah, it's going to be way more. Right, let's go Seven Oaks next, which is in just over one, two, three, just over a mile. Was well, you're here. Fair enough, uh, Callum. That wasn't me, was it, uh, Xavier? <laughs> that wasn't one of my videos. It could have been, because I was there yesterday and I saw a 37. Hey, there's Tyler. How you doing, Tyler? The Little Hampton's always cancelled, yeah. They've shortened it now, haven't they, anyway? Was it London to Little Hampton now? Or London Bridge? That bus is horrible. Oh, dear. Pop back down. Playing lawn mowing sim because you're bored. Nice. 
generally never see it actually run, there's always something wrong with that service. Seven of those don't like Little Hampton, they don't want to go there. And pop that down. Might just need to request to pass it. Well, they're saying that we are three minutes early. So we might be alright. Lovely. Love it. And put the DRA on. Shouldn't be set here long, though. Well, hopefully not too long. I can hear something over there. There it is there. Something going through there. Oh no, is there? Or is that just the um, signal post sign? I think so, yeah. Well, there's something. Oh, there's a 700. And an Electro Star somewhere as well. Probably what we're waiting for. There we go. Right, let's go. Got the signal, e yeah. Signal EP should be on. Well, that might not be on this route because this is a workshop one. You working tomorrow, Tyler? Maybe I'll see you. So I'll be at Three Bridges. Probably at the front of the dreaded car park. It's got the other line over there, which I suppose is the, the faster way into London. <laughs> yes, Xavier, yeah. Well, that was just a drag move, uh, Xavier. Just taking the 3 one freeze away. So I suppose there'll probably be another sort of five of those moves or so, four or five of those. And there we are, seven oaks. Or sneaks off there to the right. Would love the district line to be on train to mile three. That would be cool. Three seven five. Oh yeah. There's the RLU. There it is. I wonder if we have to go into the siding as well. Maybe. And here we are. That was a long journey, but that was a good journey though. Thanks all for uh, coming in for that. <laughs> Lovely for you. No, we're not going into the side. And did that open? There we go. Well, there we go. That is that. We made it to Seven Oaks. That is the full journey, and that is the new bit of line as part of version 1.1 for the southeastern network, Swanley to Seven Oaks. Very nice section, and very just yeah. It just changed so quickly. <laughs> felt like you know we're in London one moment, and it felt like we're in the Lake District or somewhere sort of mountainous. It was uh, yeah, a very big change of scenery. It's now the start of the afternoon peak services, so it will likely be more hectic for the trip to Welling Garden City. Take a break for now. Scenario complete, made by Cranky Bot. Nice, and I wonder if there is a part two to that. Um, but yeah, that is going to be it for me. Hopefully, everyone has enjoyed it. I'll be back tomorrow evening. Uh, don't know what time. Uh, links can be found in the usual places, Discord, PayPal, Merch Store. Apart from that, thanks all for coming in, and I hope we'll see you next time. See you all, and take care. Bye, guys.